So we can finally move on to the next step, which is to select update.zip from the menu. All right, select update.zip and enter, even though we know it's going to fail. So, okay, we got that installation aborted. ADB push ota.zip space forward slash sd card slash update dot zip okay that was successful now we're going to do adb push slide root dot zip space forward slash sd card okay that was successful Next step is very similar, I'm not happy to say. So you need to have in your terminal, ready to go, dot forward slash adb space push space update dot zip space forward slash sd card. But you're not going to hit enter. What you're going to do is once you're in recovery like this, if you just see the, the phone in the red triangle but no list, you hold up volume and press power and you'll get this text list. You want to go down to apply SD card update dot zip. Now as soon as you press that a little bar is going to show up at the bottom behind the yellow text. As soon as you see that bar you want to hit enter on your terminal to enter that command and this is one of those things you're going to have to keep trying over and over again um, and I'm not aware of uh, you know any tricks like there was in the last step so you just got to keep doing it. So let's go for it here. Installation aborted. It's very important that you don't just repeat step 16 for this. You have to repeat steps 13 through 16 until you get it right. And there I got it. So after doing that, um, selecting update.zip and then hitting update on my terminal, it finally went through after several tries. And I now have the clockwork recovery mod, which is this um, cyan color. All right, so the next step in Clockwork Mod Recovery, go to the Partitions menu and Mount System. Okay, so volume down to select Partitions menu, Power. Okay, Mount System, first option, Power. Go one level back and, ex and select, okay, so the bottom option here on the list is Go Back. So we're gonna go back one level and select Install Any Zip from SD Card. Okay, a few options down. Not the first one that says apply SD card update.zip, but any, SD, or, uh, any zip file. Okay, choose zip from SD card, and we want slide root.zip, which is down at the very bottom. <clears throat> For me, anyway. Select that. It's going through it. This will finish the root process. All right, so that's completely done. Now it says reboot your phone and wait to it, for it to load completely. Okay, doing that. When my phone is loading up, I'm going to start typing what's what's going to be next here. So I'll be ready for it. Forward slash, I'm sorry, dot forward slash ADB devices. <clears throat> okay, and there it is. Um, dot forward slash ADB install super user dot APK. That's super user with a capital S. Okay, and that was successful. After a reboot, even though we don't have the uh, clockwork recovery in there for every boot, got the super user request, I'm going to allow it. And here we are. All right, so there you have it. This is by far the most difficult Android rooting process I've done yet. It's going to take me hours to sort through all of the screencast clips that I made uh, going through the, the rebooting process and um, later trying to get that uh, update flash to happen right at the right time. So, uh, you know, this one is, is definitely not easy. It's not for the faint of heart. And as always, it's at your own risk. Thanks for watching, everybody. Stay tuned to droiddog.com. Take care. Oh, my God.